Mm. All right. <coughs> oh my god, Jesus. I nearly just tore my screen down. Okay. So. You can probably tell I'm not in the best shape at the moment. I'm very unwell. I haven't ridden a matter of like 10 minutes last night that I got unwell. My team handshake? Team handshake, uh, we're doing tricolor only. Um, I don't know how long I'm gonna play tricolor for, um, but whatever. And also, in this video, I'm gonna cut in the occasional uh, deep cut gear, deep cut amiibo gear, because. Uh, those got released. I didn't get them. They uh, they got sent back by whomever got them. Some Russian dude. But um, yeah, uh, he sent it back, and I'm getting them on Monday instead, which is tomorrow. Very nice that I'm getting them tomorrow. I need to cover up my uh, my preview. So I'm not looking at that, and I'm instead looking at the screen that isn't running at like 20 frames per second. Okay. Tricolor Tier 4, Manta Maria. I'm probably never going to get to defend. But we'll see. Hmm. Maybe they'll try and shoehorn me in with a load of defenders just because there are so few of us. Well, I don't think there are so few of us. I think we're actually quite evenly matched, but... Whatever. In other news, in Japan, the... Imagawayaki, Im 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 I think it is? They're winning. Big man's team. <coughs> Big man's team is winning in Japan at the moment. So, Chef is not winning anywhere. I was expecting um, Obanyaki to win because I remember, if you remember my post <coughs> about the JP Splatfest, I said that the, um, the demographics for which which is which is said the most is um <coughs> holy shit <laughs> for which is said the most is Obanyaki, Kaitenyaki, and then Imagawayaki. Um. I think it's Imagawa. It is Imagawa. So I expected it to be in that order, but no, at the moment it's Imagawayaki, which is the least popular out of the three in terms of the poles that was right around Japan. Oh my god, we're defending. <coughs> Crazy. Uh, I den. Okay. Oh, this is a nice spawn area. I like this spawn area. Yeah. I've heard the, um... I, well, I've not heard. I saw that, like, the ultra signals go there, which is crazy placement. I like this sponge. They need to be more, like... Just defensive sponges and sponges that don't necessarily lead anywhere or aren't necessarily made to lead anywhere. I wish they had more of that. Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Get it, get it, get it. Dingus. I really like this spawn area, actually. It's really unique. Oh, come on. Get it. We're aiming right at it. Oh, no. That was their team. Yeah, see? That's a crazy sprinkler placement. It's insane. Um. Huh. 
It's actually a really interesting map. I quite like it. <coughs> I thought I was going to hate it. But it's really good. At the moment. Okay, why are we letting Shrek win? That's what this color reminds me of, is Shrek. Damn it. Messed it up. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go for Team Shrek over here. I don't like this though. I would like, I, I would like, I think, a way back into base for attackers here. Just make that paintable or something. Like I feel like the ways back into base as an attacker here are not. In fact, there is no way that I'm seeing. That was bullshit. That didn't happen. Why is it whenever I go to like the other side, the other team starts winning? a lot with these games. It's like pretty even at the moment, except for us. We're not doing too hot. Yeah, there's not really much access into enemy spawn here. <coughs> I would like more access into enemy spawn. That would be nice. Like, I'm not seeing much of a way to get in there. I think they've got too much room. And there should be a way in to their spawn. Because it also means that there's no way for them to get back into their spawn. So that's kind of annoying. Yeah. And it makes it hard to defend against also. Yeah. I think if, um... The enemy spawn is going to have that much, like free real estate, then we also need to have that much free real estate on the defenders. <coughs> and we just don't have that in this map. We just don't have that much at all. That brief glance that I looked at. But we're going to keep going. <coughs> mm. yeah, this is Big Brother. Yeah. Is the way for them to get back into spawn? I'm not seeing one. Okay, why are three of us going after the same team? It's not good. Oh, come on, get it! Oh my god, just... <laughs> just keep shooting at them. You'll get them eventually. Sat still, like <laughs> ah. <coughs> Yeah, how do you get into their spawn? You don't, do you? That's really weird. It's really annoying actually. It's like in a mood where you have to defend. kind of areas. Oh, come on. Don't be scared. In a mode where you have to kind of defend your areas a bit more. You think it'd be imperative to have a way into, like, enemies' regions? But no. Like, they have so much room back there. And we don't get that. I feel weird. 
I just sat here. <laughs> oh, come on. <sighs> that, uh, that squatter isn't doing too hot. Hmm. Okay, we're attacking. This is where I can really review if he has so much room. It's a shame I've not really got painty weapons here. Hmm. I'm actually just gonna paint spawn a bit. Build some uh, zookage. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh, I love doing that. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. I shouldn't have contributed to that. Yeah, we're gonna let them go for it. Nope, we're not. We're just gonna go for it ourselves. Ah, oh, close. God, spotting players are such nerds. Sorry. I say this about every weapon that I just don't like dealing with. Such nerds. Oh, they saw me. I didn't really hide it very well there. We also get the ship, like, there's no, there's really no way for enemies to get in there. There's no way for me to get in there, back in there, like, there's not. That's really weird. God, they, people go off your trail in this game so quickly. Oh, there me too. Go for it. Distract him. Please distract him. Oh, good boy. Or oh, you never. Oh. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah. Oh my god. Ooh, that was rough. <coughs> yeah. I'm having a tough time actually. Uh. you it actually hang on what my chill season outfit is gonna be ah no okay here look let's see if i can find it this that's the chill season outfit um it's based on my well it's like it's got a mixture of inspirations it's firstly based on my profile picture where I've got the where I've got the hoodie and also I wear a mask in my second channel you know um, I'd, I'd add a pair of shades on it if I could but I can't but the uh, the reason I say it's based on that is because it's also been that profile picture was based on from South Park. Uh, that's where the whole disguise came from. Was Kenny from South Park? Because if you look at him, the only part of him that's actually visible from the amount of hood that's on his face is his eyes, and that is what would be visible of me if I had, if I was not wearing my shades in it. So that was the inspiration for it to put my hoodie that I had my like turtleneck hoodie type of thing over the front of my face um yeah. <coughs> so that's why that's why I've got the fluffy hoodie because that's what he wears and uh, I also wanted to at least have my mouth and nose covered in it that's why I'm wearing a mask in it This map is like okay. My only qualm with it is like it's just that <sighs> it's irritating that there's no there's no way back into spawn. Um, you know, I just think it would be really good. And also, even if it was just a way for defenders to get into spawn, like there's a there's a defender sponge leading into a base that would still be better like i i do think that defenders should have a way into our base and that we should not get that much real estate as an attacker like it's too much it, it was the same issue that i had with the original sturgeon shipyard map because they basically just took sturgeon shipyard added some blocks on the side and that was it and the attackers got so much space to themselves that it was just so difficult to defend against because it would be so easy for attackers to keep that much real estate to themselves and to cover it and to just win because they have so much more room to paint than the defenders do and they've fallen back into that problem with this map in that we get all of that real estate back there yeah. And the defenders don't get that much at all. Shit. Okay, this looks like a uh, team custard because that's the color of 
that. Looks like Team Custard is not quite getting that the attackers are working together in this one. Or maybe the one defender that they might not be together. But by which I mean they're not communicating, but you know. <laughs> okay. They're putting a lot of pressure here. Yeah, that's all I come in. I must admit. Good. Whoever's placing the beacons isn't very good though. Like those are terrible places to put beacons. Oh yeah. Why does it travel along the walls there? That's weird. I don't think the wave breaker should travel along the walls. Disagree. They did not hit me there. Supposedly that was a direct hit. I completely disagree. There was no way that was a direct hit. <laughs> that makes no sense. Sorry, I've just seen someone speaking elite speak. That's crazy. Elite speak in 2023. That's insane. Okay, what? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Don't like that.
Oh, I got that. I thought that was there. Tactical. Get it. Dinguses, just climb it. Just climb it. Stop being afraid to climb. I wonder if that's a thing sometimes. Like people forget. Oh my god, you can climb the wall. <laughs> oh, you know what? Fucking. Why are we letting them get it? I guess they are. Not in the best place, but. Yeah. Uh, I should have got them with the first hit there. I think I think the last thing I'll the note I'll end this on is that I wait how far am I from I'm very close okay I'll play until I've got that then yeah um I was I was I was very happy when they announced that 
Snipe Rider was getting a new kit. Not because I wanted Snipe Rider to get a new kit, necessarily. Well, I did. I want everything to get a new kit. But... That's not the reason I was happy, right? It's not, it's not because they specifically chose Sniper Rider. It's because... Of... The fact that Sniper Rider was not shown in the chill season trailer. And... That gave me hope. Because usually what they show in the trailer in terms of the new weapons that are going to be in the game is all there is to do. They don't do anything else after that with new weapons. The weapons they show in the trailer is all there is. And this time around, that was not the case. They they missed one in the trailer. And they they added a new one to the list. Um, though I did notice that the, the reflection on the Nouveau logo on the, like, plastic bit of the, the Snipe Rider was, like, really dodgely rendered. Like, it was not rendered correctly at all. Anyway... I was happy when they showed it off because, like, it at least makes me more, like, it makes me less pessimistic about this chill season, you know? Okay, they should be dead, come on now. Cock nose. Why are they jumping? Okay, what is going on? Ah! Pay attention to this, please. Yeah. This is something I will say is a bit annoying, is the fact that they put this on a pillar that can only be reached, well, it can't only be reached that way, but they put it on a pillar that can be reached with uh, ratings. But I preferred what they did with Mincemeat. Oh, come on. I preferred what they did with Mincemeat, where they put a hole in this, and they just put this on the floor. I would much prefer if they did that. That's another complaint I have about this. Otherwise, this is actually pretty solid. I actually would... I, you know, that is... This, this thing is not, like, my biggest issue, you know. I'd be happy. I'd still be happy with it if they didn't change that. Um, the only thing I would change is I would add, like some way into spawn, into attacker spawn. I think it's unfair that there isn't one. And that we'll never truly get much of a inning on their side. Because, oh, Green Manny! We'll never get much of an inning on their side. Because, um, because they've got so much space. <coughs> so that's a bit annoying for me, but it's fine. You think that'll finish the catalogue? I know I can technically not finish the catalogue because I've already got this reward, but you know. Hmm. Oh, come on. <coughs> what were we on before? It was like 6,000 and something. 
So I may need to do another two games. That'll be annoying. Let's change weapon. Hmm. Let's do it. I can't wait for the new S Blaster kit. That'll be nice. Th this is this is the thing. Like, am I still a, am I still slightly pessimistic about this season? Yes, but I am also. The kits seem genuinely fun, and seem like something I would actually want to play, even if I'm not getting my Nautilus and my Flingser kit. You know, even if I don't end up getting those this season. And there's still a possibility we might. We don't know how many we're adding in this season. You know? But in the situation that we don't, I will at least have an S-Blast kit that I want to use. Because, like, I've wanted to use S-Blast, but I hate the kit. And it's now getting, like... It's now effectively getting Grim Range Blaster treatment. Like, that's so cool. And I don't know when they can't. I can't wait to play that. I can't wait to pick that up. Um, what was the other good kit that I saw? There was another one. I forgot what it is. It can't be that good if I can't remember it right. But what was it? I don't remember what it was. But there was another one I remember liking quite a lot. Squeezer, I think. <coughs> Auto bomb and probably smoke, smoke color. Oh, and um, in terms of and Perry's, I'm actually not too bothered about and Perry Smart Julies. I thought they were like okay in Splatoon 2, um, but I definitely loved it for combination with inkjet but but I wouldn't necessarily okay I wouldn't necessarily like care for it I I, I would much prefer if they brought in the burst kit but obviously if they're gonna do that they're gonna wait for the third kit if they even We've already got Kenza Dooley's, basically. Because uh, Kenza Dooley's was Suction Bomb and Baller. Well, wouldn't you know it? That is what the kit currently is. It's Suction Bomb and Crab Tank, which isn't Baller at all. It's very different from, sport, from Baller. Uh, a similar vibe, you know. Disagree. <coughs> it, it's green again. It's Shrek again. Why are we just letting them ahead? Are we really deep in that Splatfest that much? Also, Crab Tank hasn't had a kit yet. I think we're going to get one this season. I think we might get it on Blaster. Custom Blaster might get Crab Tank. It's my query. It's my is my kind of guess there. What else could get Crab Dunk? Reflux could get Crab Dunk. That'd be stupid. Why would they do that? Uh, chill. Seasoned. Weapons. Not 2022, 2023. <coughs> uh, 
S blast. If S blast gets fucking crab tank, that's insane. That's a ridiculous kit if it gets that. Stamper doesn't need it. Splatoon at least can't get it. Uh, Squeezer could, but I agree with the theory that it's going to get Splatter color screen. I think either Squeezer or Blaster is going to get Splatter color screen. I'm really cold all of a sudden. Did I get, um, I can't even check now, we'll play another game then. <coughs> it feels so weird moving so slowly. you can get it's like the only time you can actually get five players with tender missiles <laughs> so to attack with tender missiles is actually really satisfying in my opinion it might be less satisfying on this map because while we do get a lot of real estate back here oh look at that isn't that just gorgeous not really, but... Shh. Let me have it. Yeah, throw it at me. Cool. Yeah. I know they'd be terrible in play, but I think it'd be a cool little note. Oh, we both got. Oh, they've got stamp. Uh, not stamp. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't notice me. <laughs> they just didn't notice the massive fucking text on their screen. <laughs> shouldn't do that. They should change that, but it's what it is. Get that way. Nice. 
Wow. Uh. All right. Okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh. Mm. Anyway. <clears throat> bum, bum, bum. Cool. Uh. All right. I don't know if I'll play any more of this. Uh. Well, I will play for the Amiibos, obviously, but... I don't know if I'll play much more of this season. I'm kind of done with it. I just want to wait it out for the next one, to be honest. So, um... Yeah. That's it for now. This game... has bummed me out this season, actually, for Drizzle season. Yeah, I, I've... I've found it really dull through Drizzle season, so... With my new, like, optimism about this next season. And this kind of weird... Half confirmation that that they are picking up after developing so much of Side Order in terms of like the main game updates now is reassuring, and I like. I'm starting to feel a bit more happy about this game. <laughs> so well, that's very cool. Um, it's very exciting. So yeah. Uh, let's, uh, keep our eyes open. I will obviously be continuing to post my updates on my community page for the following chill season. I'm going to draw my Officer Oni character in his chill season outfit now. I'm not doing art for the spot first. I, I don't have anything in mind. There's not really anything I had... I drew some time ago a picture of him in a really formal outfit with like a rose between his teeth. And I think that would be pretty good. Uh, but I've already done that idea, so it's a bit late for that now, but whatever. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I've been a specified. Sorry, I was about to say something I can't say. I don't think I can say anyway, but... Tell me, dudes.